So we've been at this for about, what, about 12 minutes? Probably have gotten up and walked to the drawer to get the, thing, uh, the collar out, I'd say probably about close to 20 times. So let's go ahead and try it for the 20 or first time. Now it's still a little bit more excited than I like because you can hear the dog breathing heavy, but she waited and let the human go first. She walked over second, she sat down on her own, and she is noticeably calmer. Uh, people watching at home will have the benefit of being able to watch these videos back to back and see the difference. For us, it's been 15 minutes, so it seems a little different. But the energy that we have now is much more controllable and more balanced or closer to balanced than we had when we first did this. All right, now because uh, harnesses are designed for dogs to pull, we're actually gonna use a martingale collar and I'm gonna show you off camera how to apply a special twist of the leash that's gonna give you more control of your dog. But this is the after about taking our time and pausing, and I'll explain, I guess, above and below this video, when we need to pause, when we need to stop to help the dog return or maintain a more calm demeanor when we go through the leashing up process.